It's broad review time here at cyclingphysio.com and today we're talking about a product called the Rumble Roller. Now the Rumble Roller is very very similar to your standard foam roller with the obvious exception that it's covered in bumps. Now these bumps um, change it from just a standard sort of fascia release to sort of a deeper more of a trigger point release style roller. Now I've been using this roll for about two months now and I've got to tell you, it's a very good product. It works well. It does exactly what it's designed to do. And that is to work a little bit deeper than a standard foam roller and get into some of those myofascial trigger points. Um, I've been using it on my IT bands. And I've got to tell you, the other day I went back to a standard foam roller to do a bit of a side-by-side -side comparison. And there really is no comparison. Once you can roll on the rumble roller without crying, if you go back to a standard foam roller, that you really wonder what all the fuss was about the first time around. Um, the only drawback I would say with this product is, is probably its greatest strength. It's very aggressive. If you have acute IT band pain that is quite severe or it's new, this wouldn't be where you would want to start, I don't think, because it would be um, hard to believe that someone could even roll up and down on this once. You would want to start for a few weeks on something more standard like a, a regular foam roller, and you can really, every gym in North America has got these in them now, but uh, if you've got more chronic myofascial trigger points and that sort of thing, A, you should be dealing with that by having muscle imbalances worked out and all that other thing, but to get rid of some of the tightness that develops with muscle imbalance, the rumble roller really, really does work well. It's a great product. Check out the link. Um, it's well built. It's going to last forever. It's got good weight. Um, I like it.